Hello guys, Adam from House of Smoke and Fire. It is an amazing day here today in Goulburn. What are we doing? Well, we've got a new toy. We are just burning in a uh, brand spanking new, only just released in Australia, technically not for sale till the end of the month. So we get a bit of an early preview, the Weber Smoke Fire. Have a deck of this little baby. Have a deck at this. Is this not one of the prettiest things you've ever seen in your life? So this is the Weber Smoke Fire. This is the big bopper, the EX6. Have a look inside. Stainless steel grills, GBS grill system. For those who don't know what GBS is, you can remove that insert, put things like pizza stones, uh, cast iron trivets, all sorts of bits and pieces, locks and everything like that. Look at the finish on, bright and shiny. Bit hard to see the display in the sun. Really big display, easy controls, four ports for your eye grill sensors on the bottom. Couple of tool racks here. Amazing fat and ash management system in here, which is really, really cool. Um, it's a pretty thing. So what are we doing? Well, initially I was just gonna fire this thing up, burn it in like the instruction says, and just sort of shut it down, but I'm excited. So what I'm gonna do, we've probably got half an hour or so in the initial burn in. I'm gonna go get something from our mates at Heritage Country Meats. We're gonna do a cook up today. So I'll keep you posted. Stay tuned. Look at that thing. Is that not one of the prettiest things you've ever seen in your life? So I'm here, I'm inside the fridge of Heritage Country Meats. Have a look, look what we've got. What have we got? Beef short ribs. Look at these babies. So we're gonna take them, we're gonna trim them up, throw them on the smoker. So guys, when you're shopping in Heritage Country Meats, look for this label, House of Smoke and Fire recommended. Jeremy and I have been working on some really good cuts of meat specialized stuff, stuff specifically for low and slow and barbecue. Have a crack at it. Okay guys, so truth time. Absolutely stuffed the trim video. Um, in essence, all I did was uh, I split straight down the middle, um, like across the bone of course, um, into two or three rib lots, just because I prefer the look of them that way. I think you get a bit better sm sort of smoke coverage around that. So I trimmed them, flipped them over, pulled the membrane off the back, threw rub on them. That's all I did. But I screwed the video, so uh, we don't get to see that. But have a look at this. Are you ready? Are you ready? Look at the progress on these babies. Absolutely singing. Gorgeous units, ticking along nicely. Um, it's been sitting at around 110 degrees, throwing plenty of smoke. Love and life here. Very impressive. Smoke fire, amazing. Okay, I've just finished wrapping these little babies. Here they are. They're pretty much at target temperature. I'm gonna rip them off in a second, chuck them in an esky. We'll eat them in a few hours. See you shortly. Okay guys, sorry about the smash cut editing. Can't do thing, don't have three hands. But let's have a look at this. Here's the result. Have a deck of that. Look at a smoke ring. If you're gonna complain about something like that, then you're a tough crowd. Check that baby out.
Look at this. Weber smoke fire. First run. Hit one. Take one. This is supposed to be for dinner. We've got plenty though. I'm going to smash a few. The rest are still resting up. Okay, so final verdict. It's an absolute cracker. The rest is sitting around. It's still resting. Um, we're not having them till dinner tonight. We've got friends coming around, but uh, well done, Weber. Good job on the smoke fire. Cheers, everyone. Oh, smoke fire.